Following up now on the coronavirus, public health leaders in Illinois are getting ready to make their way to Washington, D.C. That's right. They'll update Congress about the state of coronavirus in Illinois. But before leaving, they stopped at the state capitol to update lawmakers there on the latest. WCIA3's Gabrielle Franklin joins us live from our Capitol Newsroom tonight. So, Gabrielle, what does the state say it needs from Washington? Well, Paul, Public Health Director says that the agency wants to continue to be proactive when handling the virus, but they say in order for Illinois to continue to do that, they will need more resources from the federal government. The risk to the Illinois uh, public still remains low, but we still want people uh, to pay attention to what's going on around the world and so prepare. Health Director Ngaze Zike says the state will need more supplies to combat the novel coronavirus. We, of course, we're using them daily, mm -hmm. uh, so I know the last count was about 2,200, mm -hmm. and so we're uh, requesting for the CDC to send additional uh, reagents so that when this runs out, there won't be any pause and we'll continue to test. Lawmakers say they are pleased with public health's aggressive approach so far, but wanted to know more about the state's protocol for testing possible patients. Public health does not do direct testing for the public. Um, we get the samples after their clinician has done their evaluation and has done their assessment. And so we would tell them about that process and, and let them uh, go through those channels. After doctors and hospitals around the state diagnose patients with possible symptoms of the virus, test samples are sent to public health's testing labs. A process lawmakers worry won't work if the virus becomes an epidemic. I mean, if we see that this is spreading, we probably would need to have some place people can just go because a lot of people can't even go to the doctor. They, they don't have the money. They're just not connected. So what do we do about that? That's something that we really need to consider and not just wait until we see a, a bigger outbreak, but to be prepared for that. Public Health says they are considering a drive through style testing so that people won't have to get out of their cars and risk the possibility of contaminating others. But for now, their latest labs in Springfield and Carbondale are open for testing, as well as the original lab in Chicago. Paul and Jennifer. Sounds like a novel idea. Gabrielle, thanks.